are you looking for a way to make money on YouTube you hear about all these youtubers making money on YouTube and I'm gonna show you the basic way every single youtuber can make money and that's by monetizing their account and many people don't understand the rules that are behind it and how you get to that point so today's video is how to monetize your YouTube account if you're already monetized then you don't need to watch this video because I'm basically going through the steps for a new youtuber what they need to do to um, plan to get to that point where they can start to monetize and even then it's not guaranteed but I definitely um, want to make sure as a new youtuber that you you understand how this works and what you're working towards because it does take time and some people give up before they get to that point and that's what you need to be striving for so welcome to my channel my channel is I am here to help you on my channel to earn money save time and find balance in your life and this is definitely one of the ways that you can start to make money all right so let's get started I want you to log in to your YouTube account and you're gonna to go to off to the left hand side you're gonna go under channel and then you're gonna go under status and features and what I want you to look at if you're already reached the mile marker where you can get monetized then you're ready to do this step if not I'm going to show you how you what the goals are for you to get there so when you become monetized one of the things you want to do is enable monetization so again it's on the channel tag on the left hand side under status and features and right here you see where it says monetization and you're going to enable that now here's the click the, the little problem you have to have 1,000 subscribers and 4,000 hours of watch time and I know a lot of people will get to that 1,000 subscribers and think all right I'm there 4,000 hours takes a lot more time to get now some people say they've done it in two months three months that's great um, they probably made a really good video figured out how to get YouTube to recommend it and they had lots and lots of hours watched on it and that is what we all hope for but if not if you're plugging along it might take you a year and I've heard some people say it's taken them two years as of today on my channel as I'm doing this for you I'm over halfway there and I've been working on this since January and I would say my first three months I really did not know what I was doing I was growing subscribers at a horrendously slow rate um, and then I just started um, watching other people's videos on how to do certain things to get more subscribers and what to do to get more watch time and that's why you're here today um, and that's what you need to do is just keep educating yourself getting better at what you're doing and then things will continue to pick up so if you're not monetized yet and you want to be hang in there don't stop but the first thing you're gonna do is once you um, hit those mile markers you'll hit monetiz monetization and you'll enable that now what I want to show you now is you're like well how do I know um, how close I am to those hours now I'm a, a math teacher and right away when I see those minutes in my analytics I could do the math real quick but not everybody can do that so I'm going to show you a way where this will convert for you okay I want you to slide down here where it says analytics and you're going to click into analytics now when you first get in here it's going to show you your watch time in the last month and you want to know what my watch time is in the last 365 days because remember you have to have 4,000 hours within a year the last 12 months so then you're going to scroll to the top see here it says last 28 days I'm going to change it to the last 365 days whoops So I've changed it and now it's telling me my watch time in minutes okay for the year now what I want to do I went down and I hit watch time on the left and this is my watch time for the past year and like I said I'm, I'm over halfway there but maybe you want to see what it looks like in hours so you're going to hit compare metrics and then you're going to go down and hit more metrics and what it should do is do a conversion for you and put it into hours all right so you have compare metric go down here right below and it says watch time hours and it will do the conversion and now that hundred and twenty five thousand minutes will go to hours and if you look across the top you see one hundred and twenty five thousand minutes and go over to the right here 
and you can see 2000 watch time hours. So it's a little bit higher than halfway there. And, um, which is great. So once that hits 4,000 hours and the subscribers hit 1,000, then you have to send in an application to become a partner with YouTube and they will review your account and it will take anywhere from one to three months. So we are not guaranteed that we will become partners. And you might think, well, what does this mean? Well, it means that you can run ads, other people's advertisements on your videos and you see how sometimes you go to somebody's video and you open it up and there's a, an ad there well they get paid for that and I'm going to explain to you how that works again I'm not doing it yet but I think it's important that we know this information so that when we get to that point we know what's coming and honestly if you didn't know you had to wait three months you might have been really disappointed so you do the hard work then you have to wait to get approved so in the meantime you want to make sure you're creating content that YouTube wants it's what people are looking for it's not always um, the fancy ones um, I know sometimes people think well their their video is really fancy and they're probably gonna you know YouTube's gonna want them it really is more about the content um, it's a search engine what are people looking for and that's why you'll see some videos go viral that are maybe um, sarcastic humor people love that stuff they want to they play it over and over and over again they laugh people like to be entertained so a lot of times those videos do go viral and YouTube likes that and they want to put an ad on there because the more people that watch the better it is for them it's all about making money so where you come in is you want to make sure you're providing videos that people are searching for for content and there's a lot of videos out there I've got them myself on how to do uh, search engine optimization look for keywords and things like that um, and that's what you keep working at to get better um, at making sure people find your video all right so what are we gonna do next the next thing that you would do is set up your account that once you're able to be monetized is you want to go to Google AdSense and you want to set that up in your account and you can do this part now if you want to um, just to be ready um, and you go in um, follow directions yeah, you use your Google email Gmail account set it up and then you're gonna go back to your YouTube account and on the left hand side you're going under channel again and this time you're going under advanced and what you want to do is right here there it says AdWords account linking you want to hit that button go through the steps there's a code that you have to put in from AdSense and it will connect your YouTube account to Google Ads and eventually you're also going to have to have that connected as well um, because when Google starts putting ads on your videos they have to have that connection to your account so again you can hook that up now and you you can pay to have ads run if you would like um, you use that same connection or later those ads will be run on your videos from YouTube now once you're approved you will enable the ads um, you um, Google YouTube or Google will get a hold of you and say yes you've been approved you can be a YouTube partner with us and then you can say okay these are the videos that I want to put the ads on some people want to put them on all of them some people will go in and select certain ones but I want to show you how to bulk upload it real quick again this isn't something you need to do um, right now because you're not approved but I just want to show you how quickly that this can be done again it's good to have the knowledge you can go back when you get approved but you're going to go into your videos account on the left hand side and up here you're going to select all everything on this play on this um, list that you have and then you're going to go under edit and one of your choices under edit will be um, one of the actions will be monetize and that's when you're going to hit that monetize button and then it will give you the um, opportunity to select the type of ads that you want you might say that you want ads um, to be there's different ways that you can put ads on your channel notice some people put them at the beginning some people run them across the bottom some people put them in the middle of their video so you'll have all those different choices of how you want those ads to be run and then you just hit monetize at the end and it's all set up and ready to go so it's that simple when the time comes and again you could go in and do it individually and put variety or just bulk upload it all at once now a lot of people ask well how do I get paid and like I said um, there is a threshold um, you have to have a um, hundred dollars in your account before you get paid and 
what YouTube does or Google does is you have to earn it in 30 days. So from January 1st to the 30th, if you earn a hundred dollars, they will pay you and but you will not get paid for 60 days so think about that if you earn the money in january you won't get paid until march if you earn the money in march you won't get paid till may and you have to earn a hundred dollars before they'll pay you out um, so they'll keep it in escrow into your account into the next month if you don't make it now a lot of people i had the same question well how many clicks do i need to get a hundred dollars and this can be discouraging and this is why I'm telling you now so you know what you're coming up against. Um, from what I have researched, you need 75,000 to 125,000 views just to make $100. So on these accounts where you're seeing they have 10 million, 12 million views and they're making good money, that's why. So you do then, now you wanna get your hours up, but then later when you get paid, you wanna get those clicks and get your views up. So both of them are important at different times of your journey. So right now, keep working on the time it's being watched and later you'll be working on the views, um, which is just as good. All right, so hope that helps. At least you know what you're up against, what you need to work towards. It gives you a goal and don't give up. It does take time, but you're just gonna keep working at it and keep getting better. So at below, I have a video um, for a checklist for YouTube. So if you're new and you're just watching this and you're not really sure what you need to do to get set up, I have this in a playlist um, for beginner, uh, youtubers that are beginners uh, so go ahead and hit the playlist and I have some other videos in there that will help new people and I also have a checklist if you're setting up your account you want to make sure that you've done everything you need to do then um, go ahead and get that free checklist that I have and I don't know if you've noticed um, throughout my video you could see vidIQ that I use um, there's a lot of data that kept popping up um, each time you were on those pages. So I just went ahead and put that link too, um, because that really will help you in trying to find keywords and analytics and things like that. Um, I love that vidIQ. I am using TubeBuddy right now at the same time, still trying to decide which one I'm gonna upgrade. Um, Cause when you're li little, <laughs> um, everything is cheaper. Um, but as you grow, you start um, having to make some decisions on what tools that you wanna use. So I put the vidIQ down there for you and well, I'll put the TubeBuddy too. Um, and that way you can look at both of those use them both or use one all right give me a thumbs up hopefully this was helpful um, ask questions in the comments below i'd be happy to answer those for you